six days. That's how long you have to empty that drawer of plastic paper bags in your kitchen. As the day approaches, there have been several calls to the government from manufacturers to go slow on this ban. But the government says it won't budge. It is something that we should have done many years ago. Consider this, that Kenya is a signatory to the Sustainable Development Goals. And we cannot reverse our global contribution to Sustainable Development Goals. We made the announcement in February this year, but this discussion has gone on in Kenya for 15 years. In fact, in 2007, the Kenya Association of Manufacturers asked for more time. This is 10 years later. As Kenyans, we have to be ready. One of the things that have been cited as a good reason to get the government to back off the plastic carrier bags is that it will result into massive job losses. But this, the ministry says, is just simply an excuse. You know, I've been asked about loss of jobs. I've not been asked about creation of jobs. What I'd be interested in is an analysis to see how many jobs are likely to be lost because of phasing out plastic carrier bags and how many jobs are likely to be created because of the possibility of alternatives. Some traders in Kikuyu town have already started adjusting to the new order, selling kiondos to customers ahead of the ban. Others are already using khaki bags to pack vegetables. Dio kila mtu asoe kubeba chondo, akienda kwa soko. Tuase kusumbuana, niweke kwa karatasi, na mi nikisema sina karatasi na ya nasema, the government says that it won't back down because Kenya has a responsibility to meet the regional obligations of environmental protection and that this ban is only the beginning of a larger cleanup. We are also um, constructing a medical waste factory in, uh, in Rwai. The cleanup will include the relocation of the Dandora dump site and already the ministry has acquired 2.1 billion shillings from the Italian government to construct a landfill in Gong for the relocation. The environmental impact assessment and feasibility studies for this project have not yet been done, but the process is expected to begin in about a month. Zainab Wandati, NTV.